Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Geminis. Welcome back, Gems. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Gems. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Gems, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages source your guardian angels and ancestors have for you in regards to love, Gems. Yes, Love, love, love is in the air, gems. Shout out to the evolving spirit. Shout out to the soul tribe. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. I appreciate you. I thank you so much. Your love never goes unnoticed here on this platform. If you would love to become a evolving spirit, please click that join link down below. It gives you exclusive discounts on your personal readings, your email questions, and your love live stream questions when I go live, my loves. And welcome back to the ones that are new here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell on your way out, my loves. All right. So first, we're going to start with this Lesson Soul Journeys deck here. Okay. We want to tap in with your higher self. See where you're at on your spiritual journey here for the beginning of the month here of July. Yes. New cycle, new opportunity. All right. New month. New day, new opportunity, I say. So we're going to see where you're at spiritually here in regards to your spiritual readings that I've added to the content for you. All right, and then definitely stick around. I'm going to pull out the Love Romance Angel deck and dive deeper into your love life. Of course, we'll use the Tarot deck and then we'll finish up with some spiritual advice from your guardian angels and ancestors, okay? Source angels, ancestors, please protect my space and aura. Most of all, my heart. As I channel the messages here today for Gemini placements, what do we have for Gemini placements when it comes to their soul path and soul journey here, Guardian Angels? What do we have for the gems and cross watchers? Welcome back, my loves. You are welcome here as well. What do we have for the gems? What do they need to know spiritually here in regards to their higher selves? What do they need to know spiritually here in regards to their higher selves, Guardian Angels? ancestors of the highest light what do they need to know spiritually here whoa thank you we have success fuck it up if it can stay in my hand gems okay some of y'all might be all over the place a little bit for the month of july okay honey you might be bouncing here bouncing there you may have a lot of projects and tasks and things to do okay that involves success honey okay we have success i know that there is no greater goal than to love yes my loves love 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 as i always say is in the air honey okay so you're gonna be in the energy of you know falling through with success here okay you may could be starting on a new business adventure here a new business project here something that you're going to be adding to your life here you guys are going to be manifesting here in the month of july for your spiritual path and spiritual journey here going towards your dreams okay going towards your passions here okay what else gordon angels for the month of july for gems for their spiritual path what else during their spiritual journey here that they need to know, Garden Angels? And know that there is no greater way to do it than to put love involved, okay? Whatever you're doing and you're putting love in it, it will grow, all right? Yes, we have discipline here. I can accomplish what I set my mind to, all right? A lot of purple here showing out. Purple color can be very significant here, or you're needing to follow your intuition, Open up that crown chakra, okay? All right, and focus, focus, focus. I feel like for the month of July here, gems, okay? Set some discipline in your life here this month in regards to your goals and what it is you're trying to accomplish for yourself here, okay? And then we have humor. I choose to focus on the lighter side of life, all right? Yes, all right? Being in a more positive energy, I feel like, for you, Gemini's, in the month of July. And focusing in on your goals and things that you're wanting to manifest for yourself that could flourish around this same time next year. So a lot of you all may be thinking of ways to invest, okay? Things that you're wanting to invest in to see growth in your spiritual path when you come to your finances and career as well here. So a lot of focus on self-caring, self-healing 
self-investment in yourself as well. Here's setting some distance for yourself, wanting to have a better diet, eating, right? Exercising as well and finding more ways, I feel like spiritually here in the month of July for you, Gems, to become more successful. I'm getting that song for you. I just want to be, I just want to be successful. Yes. I just want to be, I just want to be successful. That's by Drake. Okay, go check that song out. That's your Pandora song for today. Channel through. All right. I just want to be successful, Gems. Okay. This is the energy that you're focusing in on here. A lot of you all are getting a coach here. You could be getting a training coach here. I'm picking up as well here. A lot of you all are getting someone that for a mentor, someone that can mentor you in regards to coming towards success here, manifesting for you here. Some of y'all are going into a partnership here as well here. Wow, I love it. So this is where you're at spiritually, mentally, and physically here for your spiritual reading here in regards of your spiritual lesson in your higher self. So for the month of June, or excuse me, the month of July, okay? I'm still sitting in the month of June here, obviously here. Some of y'all, June may be very significant for you. You may have learned some valuable lessons here and become to grow and get more of an understanding of your spiritual path and your spiritual journey here, okay, in the month of June. And so now you're going in the month of July, you're giving more gratitude, you're being more grateful and appreciative here, okay, and you're needing to choose to take life approach as a more lighter perspective, okay? Don't be so hard on yourself here for the month of July as well. I'm picking up here with this humor card. Find the humor in the situation here, okay? Find a reason that gives you laughter and growth here, okay? With that color green, find ways to ground yourself as well here for the month of July, okay? Wow, beautiful spiritual messages from your guardian angels and ancestors. So, so far, you're looking good here, okay? So, in your love life, now we're going to move forward to your love life here. Wow, we have chemistry here. Yes, honey, okay? There is a strong magnetic attraction here, Oh my goodness, gems. Okay, so there's chemistry here between you and this particular person here. Some of you all have already met this person and you are engaging with this person as we speak. Others of you all, you're going to be meeting this particular person here in the month of July, gems. That's going to be so much on a magnetic level of energy and chemistry with you. All right, what else, Gordon Angels, do we have here for gems for the month of July? I'm loving it so far. Wow, gems, okay. What else we have here? Pay attention to the red flags, gems. The signs are cautioning you. Okay, so be spiritually and physically aware of your surroundings. Okay, and people that are coming towards you here. All right, because you're going to be love bugged here. Okay, for some of you all here. But you definitely want to stay on your P's and Q's here. You want to make sure that you're still being spiritually aware of your surroundings as well here with paying attention to the red flags, okay? You may have some energies around you that may not be happy because you are choosing to be happy, okay? So just take that where that resonates. What else, Gordon Angels? Yes, look at this far right over the chemistry card here, honey. Yes, we have, yes, this is your soulmate. Lean in, gems. Yes, honey. Okay, so some of y'all are going to be meeting your soulmate here in the month of July here. What's behind here? All right, and others of you, like I said, you've already met this person here. Wow, we have let your friends help you, gems. Ask for and accept support from others, okay? There's going to be friends here that are going to want to support you here in the month of July, okay? So don't be afraid to ask for help. Don't be afraid to a self-help okay i know how you gyms are sometimes you love to do everything by yourself all right you're very multitasking beings okay you're very intelligent in that area okay but it don't hurt to ask for help to so take that lighter low remember because it says i choose to focus on the lighter side Okay, and if that means getting a lighter load as well, and you have people that are genuinely offering help and love towards you, let your load be a little lighter than usual, okay? You have help that's coming towards you, friends and family members in the month of July here as well for you. So take advantage of that help, okay? Embrace it, okay? What else, Gordon Angel? Now we're going to see what the energies that are surrounding you and how they feel towards you. 
Let's see who's thinking about you and how they feel towards you here. With the Hidden Truth Oracle deck here. Let's see who's thinking about you externally here. All right, Gordon Angels, what do we have here for gems? What do we have for my Geminis? Definitely, my loves, if the reading so far is resonating with your spirit and your higher self, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. All right, what else we have? I hid who I really am from you. Wow, so there's a particular energy out here, okay, externally here, that who that hid who they really were from you, all right? They hid who they were behind closed doors, okay? This could be an ex here. This could be someone that you were in a relationship here with, okay? This could have even been a family member here, okay? Someone that you definitely exchange energies here with, all right, gems, and they hid who... They hid, excuse me, who they truly were from you, okay? And this is why it may didn't work for you. And this is why you had to move forward here. And this is why you're being asked to pay attention to the red flags here, okay? And then at the bottom of the deck, we have, I want you. Wow. So someone else out there as well, honey, in the streets want you, honey. They want every part of you. They want your body. For some of you all here, I'm picking up, wow, all right? While you're wanting to be successful here, someone wants you, okay, honey? Someone definitely has been watching you, I feel, as well, okay? So let's see how this particular energy here, this chemistry energy here, and this soulmate energy, let's see how they feel towards you, okay, for the ones that have already met this particular person here. And others of you all, you haven't met this person yet. This person will be coming in here pretty soon. Let's see how they're going to feel towards you here. Lord and angels, ancestors, what do we have for my gems? How does this particular person feel towards Gemini placements here? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and South Node. How does this particular person feel towards Gemini? Wow, thank you. We have, let's have this talk, I'm done. Wow, so someone here wants to have a talk with you. This is a serious conversation talk when I was channeling that card there. All right, so this person who called themselves hiding from you or hiding the truth from you or just hiding overall who they were, they want to have this talk with you. They want to have a conversation with you. And some of you all, it's going to be honestly a little bit too late here because you've already met someone that is being very attractive to you. You've met someone that understands you. You met someone that understands you more on a soul level here. Okay. You met someone that's being very supportive and appreciative of you. So for some of y'all, this person might be a little bit too late. All right. Wow. Let's see. What do we have jump out here? I give up. You were right. Yeah. There's definitely an ex here that is giving up on themselves here. And they definitely want to, you know, make things up here. Okay. And they definitely know and aware that they hid who they really were from you. Okay. So definitely be cautious here. This person definitely could be watching your social media websites here. And they could be watching you just because of the fact that you have moved on here. And now they're wanting to come back in. Wow. I'm not going nowhere. Oh my goodness. Gems, you have an ex here that is very determined and they're taking over the energies here as i am trying to see how this new person is feeling towards you this person from your past is still lingering around okay yes i will make it all up to you you see that this particular new person they definitely want you they definitely want to make it up to you they definitely want to come in here okay and this particular person from your past it's like they're trying to, you know, overindulge here and step into your energy and your space, okay? Some of y'all, this person is having a hard time. This could have been someone that was very codependent on you here, Gemini's, okay? And it's been a struggle for them to let you go, okay? It's very much been a struggle here. And the more I feel like that you have separated yourself, Gemini's, from this person, rather this is someone that you could have separated from for months ago or years ago. This person now is having a hard time overcoming the separation here, okay? And now they're ready to have this talk. I feel like this person can no longer take it, all right? It's driving them crazy I'm getting here. Wow, all right? So let's see what Tarot has to say here. Let's see what's going on in Tarot land for you, honey. 
Guardian Angels, Ancestors, what do we have for Gemini placements? Again, if the reading is resonating with your spirit and your higher self, don't forget to hit that big fat thumbs up, Gems. Again, if you're new here, welcome, welcome. Subscribe, my loves. Be a part of family. This is what we love and we evolve each and every day here on this platform. And definitely don't forget to click that notification bell so that way you're notified for when I go live on this platform as well, my loves. Let's see what's going on here. Guardian Angels, Ancestors. Give me more messages here with the tarot deck for Gemini placements. What else is going on with Geminis? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North and South. Now, what else is going on with my gems? Wow, we have the World card. Yes, this cycle has complete it itself. Okay, completion is here, honey. Now, you have your free will. So, there's definitely an ex here trying to come back in, even though they are aware that this cycle, that this relationship, okay, that this marriage for some of you all is over, okay? So you have your free will. You've passed the test. You've learned your lesson here, okay? I heard Virgos, okay? Some of y'all, this person may have been a Virgo here, Geminis, okay? But you have passed the test. You do not have to go back to this person if you do not want to go back to this person, Geminis, okay? Your guardian angels let you know with the world card coming out. Anytime the world card comes out for me, there's a completion, honey. You pass the test. You can move forward. All right. Yes, we have the King of Pentacles that go that Virgo energy here. Some of y'all, this person may have been an Earth sign here, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo here. Okay. And others of you all, you're being more stable and grounded now. Right. There go that song coming back through. I just want to be successful. Yeah. So you guys are being more successful now. You got your ducks in a row. You're focusing in on yourself. All right, and you're starting over, starting fresh. Yes, we have the four of ones here. Okay, and some of y'all are coming into union here with your soulmate. All right, so not only are you being more grounded, your finances and career is kicking up here for you and everything, and you're also meeting your soulmate. You're going into a new partnership here. Wow, congratulations, Gems. I'm so happy for you. What else, Gordon Angels? <coughs> Excuse me. What else? Let's clarify the world card as we close out your spread here. Then we'll get you some spiritual advice here. Clarify the world card here, Garden Angels, for Gemini placements. Why do we have the world card here? What's closing out here? I just want to be successful. Yes, the strength card, Leo energy here. Some of y'all, this person could be a Leo here. All right, or others of you, this person could be a Sagittarius or an Aries here, this fire sign, this new person that's coming in, okay? Or again, I heard Virgo energy as well. However, we have the strength card here. This was a tough cycle for you to close out here, Gems. It took blood, sweat, and tears, but you made it. You made it on the other side. Like I said, Gems, you passed the test. All right, congratulations, kudos to you, because I know it wasn't easy. This person took you through hell and hot water, but you conquered, you survived, okay? You came and you conquered and you fucking saw, okay? And you did the damn thing. So congratulations, my loves. Let's get you some word of advice to close out your spread. Guardian angels, ancestors, what do we have for Gemini places to close out the reading here today? What word of advice can gems take away from this reading here, guardian angels? What word advice? Thank you. Yes, honey, we have show the world the real you, gems. All right, full moon in Aquarius, okay? Some of y'all, this person could be Aquarius here, or you're needing to step in that unique energy as an Aquarius here and own that shit, okay? Some of y'all may have a platform like I myself. It's time to get back control of your life. Enjoy what life has for you. Enjoy what life is bringing towards your way with this new opportunity. Your finances and your career is looking up now. You now are engaging yourself with someone who genuinely loves and appreciates you, Gemini's. I am so happy for you guys. Wow, Jim. So that has completed your love reading. Again, I hope the reading has resonated for who it needed to resonate for. If so, again, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. I am now back available for personal readings. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information is down below in the description box, my loves. Again, if you have enjoyed the energies, click that join link down below. It also gives you exclusive discounts on your personal readings. 
and email questions and love live stream questions when I go live, my loves, okay? Definitely come hang out with us on the other side. We have our own private community chat board where you can chat with me one-on-one. -on -one. I do provide additional daily readings there as well and pre-recorded readings, all right? So definitely click that join link down below and join the soul tribe, my loves. I love you all, gems, and congratulations. Bye-bye.